what's up guys in this tutorial we learn about pointers uh, many get scared when they hear pointers as in how to use them what uh, what where to use them and all those things but actually it's not that difficult it's just a bit confusing but if you uh, use them in your programs uh, you'll find it easy and and more interesting also uh, so what are pointers okay as the name suggests pointers are something which point to something okay so the next question that comes to your mind is that uh, what are pointers actually pointing to okay so pointers point to a variable whose address they store so i'll write it down it's very important pointers point to a variable whose address they store okay so how do we get an address of a variable in my previous tutorial i had said that uh, using the ampersand operator you get the address of the variable okay that operator is said as reference reference operator which basically is an ampersand okay so if i need the uh, address of a variable a i'll write ampersand a so this gives me the address of a we have used this in our scan of function of a okay as in we uh, use uh, take the input from the user and store it in a particular memory locations so we use their ampersand it's the same ampersand operator or the reference operator it gives me the address of a variable so suppose i have a pointer i have i haven't told you how to define a pointer or declare a pointer so i'm just uh, for time being i'm saying suppose ptr is my pointer and it has a value of address of a that is ampersand of a okay so this means that ptr is a pointer to a as in ptr points to a okay so now let's see another example of pointer okay uh, suppose these rectangles are my memory locations as in memory blocks its address are 2000 this block address is 2000 this memory location address is 5000 and uh, this memory location address is uh, 8000 and x y z are my variables as in, and uh, 5000 8000 and 20 are the values of x y z respectively as in x is of value 5000 y is of value 8000 Z is a value 20 and it's stored in location 2000, 5000, and 8000. Okay, so uh, as we know, the variable x is storing 5000. What is actually 5000 is the address of this y. So uh, we know that x is pointing to y, uh, similarly, y is pointing to z. So and so y, uh, y has 8000, that is the address of z okay so just i'll keep this way okay so in this question x is a pointer which has the address of y so x is a pointer to y okay i'll write x points y then i have y is equal to ambition z that means uh y points to z okay and z has a value so z so z is equal to 20 okay so what's the use of this pointer uh, suppose i want to access the value 20 that is a variable z uh, using the variable y that which is a pointer to z so i can access as star y so what it does it would access the value of variable z so what is the star operator it's known as a dereference operator and reference operator okay which is a star ah, yeah so 
using a pointer we can access uh, the variable to which it's point to which it points okay so now let's move on and uh, see how to declare a pointer so it's type then uh, then star and pointer name the rules for assigning a pointer name is same as that for uh, assigning to a variable okay so uh, what's the type of a pointer uh, in this example all our pointers are pointing to integers as in int so our type becomes int suppose i have a variable that points to a character so its type would be char the pointer type would be char so basically the type of the pointer is what it points to okay so now let's define the pointer x so i'll have my type of pointer is int so it will be int star x okay now we want the x pointer should point to a variable y so x must hold the value of uh, address of y so it would be x is equal to ambient y you can combine uh, both of these statements together to write something like this in star x is equal to ambient y okay so i would call this as okay declaring and initializing a pointer declaring and initialization of pointer Okay, so now let's try the same example in our code. I'll open a new file. Control O. Ah, uh, uh, Control N. Yeah. I'll firstly write my basic structure. Hash include. Int main, and return zero. Okay, so what we want to do in our code is x points to y. Then I want y points to z, and z should have a value of twenty. Z equal to twenty. So firstly, I'll uh, define my variables x, uh, define my variable z, and assign it to the value twenty. Int z is equal to twenty. Now I want two pointers x and y. The type of that pointer is integer. So I'll have int star x is my one pointer, and int star y is my another pointer. Now we want x to be equal to as an x should point to y. So I'll have x is equal to ambition y. And I want y to point to uh, z, so y is equal to ambition z. And now let's access the variable z using y. So I'll have a printf statement, printf value of z is. And a percentage d comma star y star is my d reference operator. I'll save this file, give it a name, pointer. Okay. So let's execute a file, compile and run. Okay. Yeah. Value of z is twenty. Okay, now suppose I want to find the address of Z. So my address of Z is stored in Y. Okay, address of Z. Address of Z is stored in my variable Y. So, so how can I access Y? I'll access it using a pointer X. Okay. So address of Z will be. Okay, so let's execute a file and see. Okay, uh, compile and run. Okay, so yeah, it's giving address of Z is uh, something like this. Okay, so what we did here is that we access the address of Z using the pointer X. Okay, 
in our uh, example y is uh, storing the address of z since y is a pointer to z so y stores the address of z so now to access y i used my pointer x so i wrote star x okay so yeah that's it on this tutorial see you in the next one please do subscribe to our channel like our video and do provide a suggestions for our improvement thank you